one of the key features of the equation of a line is the slope. This is often the most important point because it tells you how steep or how shallow the line is. The way to find the slope in mathematically is take two points and plug them into this equation. Some people, most people don't remember this equation. M, which stands for slope, equals y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. It's very abstract. I'm going to show you an easy way to deal with this. A lot of people remember it as rise over run. Essentially what we're doing is trying to find the difference in the vertical height and divide that by the difference in the horizontal height. In other words, we're going to take these two points, plot them, and then we're going to connect the dots and see how steep it is. 4 comma 2, we plot by moving 4 units to the right and then up 2 units. We're going to plot the second point by moving 2 units to the right and then one unit up. If we connect these points, we can see how steep this line is, relatively speaking. Some people will say this isn't all that steep, but if you try to run up a hill this steep, you wouldn't get very far, not for long. Uh, but nonetheless, we want to be able to quantify this. We want to be able to put a number to it so we can compare slopes and steepnesses. The way to do this, or one way to do this, is to draw a vertical line down until this is level with this point here, and then draw a horizontal line across. And you can count the tick marks. Count the vertical height between here and here, which comes out to be one unit. And we could put that in for the numerator. That is how high this thing is. And then we count over how far across this is. Run stands for running, as if you were running on a horizontal surface. So count the tick marks from here to here. When we count, we have one, two. That means two goes in the denominator. So our slope is called one half, one over two, which means for every one unit you go up, you go across two units. If we were to continue this line, we would find every time we go up one, let's say one foot, we would go across two feet. One, one, two and all of this would connect to this same line here. So this steepness is called 1 over 2, or 1 half. Obviously a steepness of 5 would be much greater. A steepness of 2 would be greater, but not as great as 5. 1 eighth would be even less steep. That's what slope is, how steep something is. 